just very clear. My dear brother and sister, why all of these miracles appear in the sky? This time, the Bible talk about this many, many thousand years ago. Some thousand years ago, Right now, year 2013, we got we do have more than seven billion brother and sister on the earth right now. And we are very school because from the power of Satan. Satan control less than, I would say about, you know, maybe one percent of the population on earth. And those guys, those one percent, they are really, really screwed up. Those rich and selfish, those screw up, mess up politics, and those selfish religious leader, and those gangster, you know. You what? You black dragon, blue dragon, I mean, green dragon, or what? Or you mafia, or you you know terrorist, or you politics and gangster, you know? Or you rich and selfish, you know? Or you terrorist, you know? Or you communist, you know? Or you overreact freedom? Who the heck? Whatever you think you are, you know? You go to face this. You think you're tough? Tough. You ain't tough. You're just human like everybody else. You, you think you're tough? I ask you a question. Do you think you're tough? You tough than this? Do you tough than this? Do you tough than this? What do you think? Think you tough? Do you learn anything? You think you tough than this? This is the attack lion, dragon lion, with seven eyes, seven head. John 5-5 five, five revelation. This lion will lock you up, lock up you, lock you with Satan. If you not repent on time. You think you're tough in this? Hmm? This will burn you.
after you die. And you will die like everybody else. And you will be burned like this for many thousand years. Hot, very hot, many thousand degrees, very hot. You think you're tough? Tough? You make me sick. But I love you, you know. I learned from the Almighty God, Jesus Christ. That is my boss, my survivor, you know, my my saver, you know, my that, that's my God, and that's the only God. Jesus Christ is your God too, but you deny Him. We all deny Him sometimes. So we are, you know, better, quick, you know, lying to ourselves, you know, lying to each other, especially lying to the Holy God, Jesus Christ, because He knows everything. Look at His eye. He look at you. He look at you very straight to the eye. He knows your past. He knows your present. He knows where you will be. Think a little bit. You think, <laughs> you think you can lie from Him? You think you can run away from him? This is the face of the Holy God, Jesus Christ. He loves you. He, he died for you. He paid for the price. There, everything paid. He asking you now is just repent and turn him, yourself to him so he can save you. Because after all, only Jesus Christ can save you and save your family and save your country. <laughs> you think you're tough? <laughs> Brother and sister, you ain't tough. <laughs> I'm sick and tired. What kind of gangster you are, you think? I mean, you know. <laughs> I mean, you know, tell me. Tell me. What? <laughs> tell me, what, <laughs> what, what do you think? You tougher than me? You think you tougher than me? <laughs> Come on. Ask yourself a question and answer. Do you think you tougher than me? I don't think so. I think one of the most of the tough guys in the universe. Not only in the earth. But without the Holy God, Jesus Christ, we are nothing. Only troublemaker, that's all. Don't lie to yourself now. The Holy God, Jesus Christ, asking you to be servant of God to help our brother and sister seven billion of us around the world to recognize about all of these important warning appear in the sky about the end is coming we don't know tomorrow, next hour, next, you know, second, next five year, next 10 year, next 20 year, next 50 year, but it's coming. To adjust, you know, the earth and to clean up our sin. We are very sinful, brother and sister. You know, I used to undergo an advisor for help. I'm not, I'm not work for them. I help them. I help Donald Rumfield. And also I help the President of the United States. 
I mean, are you to help American life, save life? Are you to help save many thousand American soldiers during the war from 2003 to 2008? You can ask Donald Rumsfeld and George Bush know about that. They will be witness. They cannot run away from God. You can ask Jerry Brown, know who am I? You can ask, you know, the old Black Panther, they know who am I? My brother and sister, you think you tough? No, you ain't tough. Me? Tough? No, I ain't tough. Without the Holy God, Jesus Christ, you and me, we are a piece of, a piece of, you know, a nut, nothing. We are, we are very lucky because we got the Holy God, Jesus Christ. Because He's the one who gives you life and give me life. Do you believe or not? It's up to you, my dear brother and sister. My job is my job is to report to you, and you are the one who, you know, to decide between you and God. But please, brother, sister, <laughs> time to party, time to make a lot of mistakes, you know, time to pung up. And now, time to repent, turn ourselves to Jesus Christ, because time is running out. All leaders around the world, you all need to contact me. So me, personally, if I can, I will come to you or you come to me to get the new message from the Holy God. Give to you. So you can deliver it to your people, your country, your group, your organization, Because all of this miracle need to be in every home on the earth, in every corner, in every church, in every temple, in every office. Because when the day coming, the end coming, it's only the Holy God Jesus Christ can save you and save your family. You remember what I say. Only the Holy God, Jesus Christ, can save you and save your family and save your country. Remember that. The ball in your hand right now, pass around. Remember, repent. Turn yourself to Jesus Christ. Exercise what Jesus Christ teaching us. Don't say that you believe in Jesus Christ and you safe. You don't need to do nothing. You know you don't know what you're talking about. Of course you, you need you don't need to do nothing. If you have no more energy left, you you know you you old, you you sick, you know, you handicapped, you you cannot do nothing. You helpless, and then only thing you can do is pray for everybody. That's all you can do. That's good. But if you still can do something, you know, you still healthy, you can move around, do something, or if you have, you know, money and you know, thing, you know, material, whatever, show them. You know. If you have some property, you know, you know, keep it enough for you, but the rest, you know, help the poor. Especially, help me to deliver this miracle to every home in the world. That's why, say, you believe in Jesus Christ, because the Holy God Jesus Christ called you and testing you to use whatever you have 
to answer his calling because he's coming. He bring all of the wonderful gift above your imagination. Okay, gift, you know, wonderful. He bring and give to you and me. But we must answer his call because he's testing you and me. And if we, you know, we, 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 we're not true that we care, you know, and then when he come, you got nothing. And also, whatever you have, you will lose everything. Because by that time, you will be locked up with Satan. Because if you not be with Jesus, then Satan get you. Simple as that. And that means you will lose everything if you not answer God's call now. Depend how you go to answer God's call. You know, God know. God know you cannot lie to God. God know everything you have. God know whatever you can do, you cannot, or you can do. We cannot lie from God. Can do you think you think you can lie from this face? Take a look. Take a look at his eye. He know your past. He know your, you know, present. He know your future will be. Where? What? He's know. He know everything. Because he is God. <laughs> My dear brother and sister. You got that? 